Ogle, the head coach in this, was driving the bus at the time, now being called a hero for his reactive driving. KOCO's Kylie Thomas has been following this all day. Kylie, you join us live tonight with that video. Yeah, on the outside of the bus, you can see how damaged this is. Both axles have been completely ripped off, but this video that you are about to see shows you just how scary that moment was inside the bus. <laughs> inside this school bus, Seminole's cross-country team fast asleep as they embark on their long trip to Lawton. You can hear the coaches talking about the upcoming meet that day, when life changes in a heartbeat. Guys, you okay? OHP says a sleepy driver had just gone off a night shift when he crossed the center line along Highway 3. That bus driver, one of the coaches, along with the other coach, calmly tell everyone to get off the bus. When a driver who stopped runs over, telling the coach's diesel fuel is leaking out. Hey, go, hurry up! Hurry, hurry up! Hurry, 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 hurry. 18 students shaken up file out one by one onto the highway unharmed. Seminole superintendent crediting Coach Sanford's reactive driving for saving their lives. It was very close to the bus being turned and flipped on his side at least once or twice, and uh, Coach Sanford avoided that and managed in the steering wheel. He didn't fight it and he didn't he didn't let go of it uh, and he kept the bus from turning over. Now again, none of those students or coaches were injured, but the driver of that truck was. He was pinned for 30 minutes before being life flighted to OU. We are being told tonight that he is in stable condition. Reporting live in Seminole, Kylie Thomas, KOCO. Five news.